Despite being able to host a regional tournament this week, the Michigan State men's golf team knew it wasn't going to be easy to qualify for the NCAA championships. The Spartans started the week by shooting the program's second best 18 hole score ever, but after today's round, MSU is left feeling defeated. With the top five teams advancing to the NCAAs, MSU entered today in fifth place at 11 under par. Tom Izzo is back out on Eagle Eye Golf Club for the third day in a row, and former Spartan James Pyatt took a break from the Live Tour to support his guys. However, it was this kind of day for MSU. Ashton McCullough can't get the birdie putt to drop on the par for third. McCullough came into the day three under, but shot a nine over in today's final round. MSU fell out of fifth place, but found some momentum on the final nine. Drew Hackett cards an eagle. Yes, eagle on the par five fourth. He had the best round for the Spartans at two under. Then just two groups later on the same hole, August Mikoff faced with the same situation. Chance for eagle and he drains it. Mikoff was three over on the day to finish the tournament even par. On MSU's final hole of the day, fifth year senior Troy Taylor the second was putting for par on the par four ninth. He would have to settle for bogey and a six over today, but he will always remember the hug he shared with his head coach Casey Luban after his final round as a Spartan. MSU shot 10 over par today and missed the cut with a total score of one under. And while the season comes to an end after a seventh place finish, Taylor's career gives them plenty of reasons to celebrate. I think you guys saw him walking off the green. He's pretty down, and, and as he should be, he's been part of this program for four or five years and been an awesome, awesome addition to it. So we're definitely going to go celebrate his career. Troy committed seven and a half years ago, and we talked to him on the phone two years before that. So that's nine and a half years he's been a part of my life. Um, and, you know, he gave everything he had. Probably at times tried too hard because he wanted to be so successful. And he's one of my all-time favorite humans.